This is the this is the only matchup that I actually can say, wow, Fireball is actually good against Biker. Only Kai players think Kai is fair? Oh nah. Oh nah, I don't know what Kai player think is Kai is fair. We all agree that this character is not fair. This character is trash. You do not put words in our mouth. We don't think this character is fair whatsoever. We think this character is trash. Please do not put words in our mouths. All right, what's going on YouTube? We are back you already know I'm about to tell you guys right now. Support your boy, okay? Support him. All right, so today's video, we went ahead and we did a biking matchup chart. We already know a lot of people like tierless and stuff like that. But one thing I know people don't like is like numbers for matchups, right? You know, people don't like the 5.5, you know, the stuff like that. We're going to switch it up to what people just say about biking. When they lose, when they win, when they have a winnable matchup, when they have a matchup in their favor, what you hear all the time. So we're going to switch it up a bit. But before we switch this up, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Let me know how you guys feel about this video. Leave a like. And let's jump into the video right now. We are on the road to 100K. So let's make that go a reality. Let's jump into it. I feel like we've been talking about how much biking sucks, how bad biking is bad in this game. She can't combo for certain ranges. You know, we we heard all of the bad things about biking. Yeah, she has very bad buttons. You know, we heard all of it. We heard it. But we haven't talked about the matches that, you know, she wins. I'm doing things a little differently today. You know, I feel like people don't like numbers. You know, I heard that people don't like numbers. Numbers are very toxic. So we're going to do something different today. We're going to literally use quotes from people in Celestial when they ready up on a matchup on the cabinet. Here we go. Look at this. Yes. These are all real quotes. Oh yeah, we know. Actually, instead of biking sucks, we just should just say Perry sucks, right? No, actually, nah, we're gonna keep it like this. We just gonna put it here as the matchup chart. Per Perry sucks right here. Perry sucks. There we go. This is how we gonna get started. Ba biking's matchup chart, Perry sucks. We just gonna go straight, straight to the obstacle course right now. No stretches, no nothing. You're gonna be done. You're gonna you gonna have poor mini muscles. Now you no no nah, no warm up. What you mean? You think you gonna you think you gonna stretch? You gonna you gonna stretch? Nah, ten miles right now, full speed. Hey man, all I'm saying, bro, is look. This is what we see. We see this all the time. You know, in the moment somebody have a bad matchup, they like, yo, this character can never win. And they be playing characters like this. They be playing characters like this, being like, boo hoo, a fair matchup that I can't win. Boo hoo. We definitely see this character and I'd be like, yo, I'm winning this. Biker has a lot of stuff to kind of like piss off Eno. But we all know the moment we get knocked down, we'd be like, yo, I win this, but this character. And this is exactly how I feel. I win this, but this character. I don't think this, I don't think this matchup is like super bad, but I think Biker actually has a lot of stuff to like bypass a lot of shit. But this character, the problem is, is like, you know, even when you try to rely on this sucky parry you could die and get exploded you know it's really bad but you know biking's ground the ground normals ground to air normals and also air to air normals are all really good against this character it feels pretty frustrating as the eno player and uh you know you have to kind of like do like a lot of like reset pressure but the problem is all your reset pressure can like die to like my great normals on the ground anji you know this is another character where I want to complain, but it's kind of fair. Like, I want to complain. Like, I really want to just, like, you know, really complain really hard. But, like, it's pretty fair. The way Anji normals kind of, like, hit, even though you can parry it very easily, if he spaces it out properly, you actually don't get the, uh, the, the parry damage. You only get the knock away. And because of that, I think Anji actually has a chance to, like, fight Biken. But I always want to be like, yo, Biken sucks every time I can't parry my shit. I, every time, like, my parry just don't do anything, I was, this, this is where I want to send him out. I'm like, biking sucks. I want to go, I want to go through the, the, live through the quotes. Live through the quotas. But, I really want to complain, but you know, I'd be like, eh, it's fair. They have kind of like a lot of counters to deal with each other in like, cool ways. I think Anji air buttons are okay, but they're not like, on, on the grand scheme of things, it's really hard to like, use okay buttons against biking. You know, you gotta you gotta be more than okay to fight air to air with biking. So you know, let's talk about Ram. Let's talk about Ram, ladies and gentlemen. 
Goo Goo Gaga time. Everybody get your pacifiers. Ram players, get your bibs and pacifiers. You guys be, you know, you guys be drooling all over the place. So get your, put your bib on. But yeah, let's talk about, let's talk about Ram. You know, this character, a lot of stuff biking can do. It's pretty good. Ram's air normals are pretty good though. So it is, it, it feels like a war. But I do like a lot of the reward that biking gets. So I want to complain because it's Ramathal. But we got to be honest here, man. It's pretty fair. It's pretty rough. It's pretty annoying. But I feel like if you want to be really serious, I could cry a bit. I could cry a bit, you know? Roll, roll some tears down. You feel me? It's only fair, right? Give me some tissue, chat. We need a, tish we need a tissue emo. I feel like Ram is those characters that can annoy you easily. Yes, by literally hitting three buttons. And they will talk about, they will look in your eyes and be like, yo, my noochie nooch nooch be nooching in these nooch. But one thing I will say is biking do have tools to fight her. It's just the life bar. It's very easy to uh, deplete. But I think due time, you might be able to fight this character. I do, get, I do think in time it might develop, but we're going to cry for a bit. Now let's get back to like the real man, right? So, you know, biking came out not too long ago and you know you got all your combos and shit, and you run into Potemkin you like yo I'm winning this you like you like okay you know you got your homies hyping you up you know yeah get that pop player get that glue eater you like yeah and you hear dual one left rock and he mashes far slash on you you like okay maybe I can win this but you know this character I think I got it right and then you realize that your air normals also lose to far slash. You like, I really want to complain, man. But like, you know, I guess it's fair. You know, pop really don't have movement. I want to complain, but I guess it's fair. But then you realize your little ass, your little jab can't stop Mega Fist unless it's parry. Because your little T-Rex jab just don't reach. And then you also realize that you don't have any block streams to Gabari that stop Mega Fist. So you like, yes, I could cry a bit. And then the worst part about all of it is that now, after all of that being countered, you're like, man, maybe I can use 2H to stop a lot of things pop do. You get counter hit mega fist. Biking sucks. Kai, I think this matchup is I wanna complain, but it's pretty fair. The reason why I think it's fair is because Kai only option really is the mid range and stun edge. Viking mid range is pretty good, but I think this is a pretty fair match. I think you can go both ways. He can't really flip kick anytime he wants. That shit gets parried from across the map. This is the this is the only matchup that I actually can say, wow, Fireball is actually good against Biker. Only Kai players think Kai is fair? Oh nah. Oh nah, I don't know what Kai player think is Kai is fair. We all agree that this character is not fair. This character is trash. You do not put words in our mouth. We don't think this character is fair whatsoever. We think this character is trash. Please do not put words in our mouths. We actually have submitted all of our paperwork. We've done everything Arcs has asked us to do, and they still haven't gave us tools yet. Kai Sora is indeed made out of napkins. Everybody just go, everybody just blows their nose. Every time, see the thing is, everybody sees RTL, but what you don't see behind the scenes, in the moment we see the super, we all just start blowing our nose. Because we know that, like, man, that's all we got. When the super don't wall break, every Kai player be like, ah, oh, man, he lost. Yes, but, you know, we can't complain. We only, we only can nod our heads and be like, you know, it's fair. It could be worse. It could be this. Which brings me to uh, another character. You know, when I go on Celestial World, I be like, yo, I'm winning this shit. Every demigod I fought, free. And then you start fighting, you know, a little technical Naga players. You're like, eh. I want to, you skip, you skip the whole I win this shit. you like, yeah, I want to complain, but I guess it's fair. And then I realized that Viking is the only character in this game that can actually beat Nagori Yuki's 2S. And I think to myself, wow, it took one whole year to find a, a solution to a button. This is the first time where I feel like all samurais have a pretty fair fight from each other. It's kind of it's kind of unreal to think about it like that. But all the samurais want to complain, but it's fair. Yeah, we 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 doing some light play, 
light complaining, you know, some little light, you know, a little, little soft, soft complaining, a little beast blaming, you know, a little, just a tiny little beast blaming, you know. Now it brings me to my next character, bro. Everybody's like, yo, Biking sucks because of Zato. Biking sucks because Zato is so good. How does Biking gonna win? Because you can't parry little Eddie. Boo hoo. But you know, I played it. And I was like, man, I used my air normals to kill Eddie? I guess you could cry a little bit. But then I realized like, I got special moves. And I have very good strong pokes. I guess it's fair, I guess. I wanna complain, but it's, you know, it's pretty fair. You know, I kill Eddie, I gotta fight Zato, so I don't have a hard time. I can kill Eddie pretty easily. It's not that bad. I wanna complain though, but you know, we gotta live on the train of biking sucks, ladies and gentlemen. This character is garbage. According to Twitter, every time I played biking for the past four days, all people came in my chat, yo man, people on Twitter saying biking sucks. What's your thoughts? Damn, I mean, I, I just hit somebody with a 90% combo, I guess. Guess she's bad. Now, we're gonna bring it to another controversial character. This character right here. This is gonna be very interesting. You know, every average player is gonna be like, yo, because this character's low tier, I'm winning this sh Jackal sucks means that my character wins this matchup because Jackal sucks. And this is people who never fought Jackal before, yes. But then, when you realize that you gotta learn the matchup, and you gotta actually interact with characters in video games, you realize that Wow, even though this character suck, she's pretty, she has some good tools against my character. Maybe I gotta learn the matchup. And then you realize that this character, who is quote unquote, not that good, actually got some against your character. And you're like, I wanna complain, but if I complain, I'm complaining about a low tier character, that means I suck. So that just means that I'm not gonna say that I suck as a player, and my character is garbage too. And because my character is garbage, my character loses to another garbage character, which means that my character actually is trash. Yes, you can cry for a bit. And I don't think it's hard, like the end of the world hard, but I think it's pretty rough. And one of the reasons why I think it's rough is because those goons be, they, they just be swinging on the screen, bro. That's kind of hard to deal with. And then you know what's crazy? Because she'll throw like a high, she'll, she'll throw like a high goon and your jab can't even hit it. <laughs> your jab can't even hit it, bro. Your jab can't hit it because they don't hit high enough. So the goons will be swinging. You definitely got to be kicking the goon. But if you don't kick right, you get kicked. Also, Jackal's 2D is actually obnoxious. You have to really tunnel vision her sweep most of the time. I ain't gonna lie. When I first played this matchup, I was like, bro, biking sucks. I played, I played K-Brad. And K-Brad was me. Uh, I was like, oh my god, this character sucks. But then, you know, I thought to myself, I was like, wait, maybe if I just not use parry and think and actually use player decision making, I was like, I guess I could cry for it. But then I thought to myself, when you actually just respect the character, it's pretty fair. It's fair. Both players are good in the air for their perspective waves. The problem is, is biking on the ground has to take a little bit more risk. And if your button gets jumped on, it's pretty bad. It's not so bad, it's not the end of the world. Now you're thinking to yourself, man, for a good, uh, for a character who sucks, man, she got a lot of even matchups. Well, let's talk about some matchups she does well in. Oh man, biking sucks. Axel, rinsing, you can't parry rinsing. But then you start like, you know, playing the mid range with her, with the mid range with Axel, and you're like, I still wanna cry though. You know, you're a 15 0 Axel player, you like, she still sucks. But then you watch a good player play, and then you really see how bad the matchup is. You're like, damn, I can't complain about this. But f Axel. And I think everybody, even Axel players, even agree. Axel. I feel like Axel players, they all have a Discord together, and they the, the, the Discord literally just says f Axel. You know, you know, Chip, they love they records. You know, they love risky, riskier, gamble it all. And when your parry miss, biking sucks. But then you realize, like, okay. Wait a minute. Let me think. Let me think for myself. Are you saying that if I don't be predictable, that I can actually avoid some of the things that I'm dying to? Damn. Well, in my world, we can want to complain, but you know it's pretty fair. Which brings to the next under character. Whoa, whoa, biking sucks right off the bat. There's no way Leo can be stopped. 
There's no way Leo has any bad matchups. Leo is Leo. Why would you play any character when you could just play Leo? But you know what's crazy? Because of the nature of this game, F this character. This character is so fraudulent. This character is so fraudulent that this character in Revelator back in the day was known for a scrub killer. This scrub killer character has evolved. I didn't even know there was an evolution stone for these characters. That's crazy. He is now the Strive Killer. Anybody who touched Strive, he kills. He is a Strive Player Killer. I didn't even know there was a stone for that. You can lose to any... Bro, you could be having a good day. You get a raise, get a new car, and a Leo come up in the Celestial Tower. That mother is going to smoke your shit. He going to take your massage back. He going to take the chair. He going to take your raise. He gonna leave you lifeless. And then his little custom message, he gonna say, great games, Leo sucks. And you gotta read that as you get back turn stance looped for four seconds. But Biking actually does pretty well against, against Leo. It's pretty crazy, right? It's unbelievable. It's unbelievable that this character actually does well against Leo. But we all agree, F this character. And I hope Arxis patches his ass and take that evolution stone away from him. We gotta go on a little louse. He's been found, so he's back to the Faust. I wanna cry, but you can't really cry to Faust. You wanna complain, but if you complain about Faust, it kinda looks bad on you, you know? I can just hear Hook's voice, bro, you complaining about Faust? You trash. <laughs> we win. We win in this. Biking does pretty okay against, against Faust. I think Biking gets pretty okay. But then, you realize that Bomb Bag is kind of OD. Faust Osco got a safe jump that looks like it is a safe jump, but they whiff and they command grab you. I'm like, wait, you command grab my parry? F this character. We ain't winning this. You gonna put a throw in my hand and go for instant overheads? And then I think to myself, I'm like, man, I wanna complain, but I guess it's fair. It's Faust. Faust came a long way. It's a pretty fair fight, you know? We gonna, we gonna respect him to another thing, you know, look. I ain't gonna lie, when I when I thought my when I playing all these characters, I'm like, yo, I'm like, yo, my air to air is playing everybody else is kind of godlike. And then you know May comes up, crawling up, and then you like, wait, her air nodes are pretty good too. But I'm like losing like 40% of my life. And then you read all the May players tweets, they like, yo, May sucks. May trash. If you lose to May, you're not good at fighting games. And so, like, you're like, man, I want to complain, but I guess it's fair. You know, I guess the Twitter the Twitter May players are right. She is, she is garbage. I can't complain about her. She lost all of her damage. And you lose to May, you're like, I'm about to fuck cry my ass off, bro. This matchup is rough. It's rough out here. I like the air to air against May, too. But when you don't go air to air with her, it's over. Giovanna. Giovanna sucks, so... I want to complain, but, you know, Giovanna sucks, right? Yeah, Geo sucks. Yeah, that's what all the Geo players say. They're like, yo, she garbage. But then I realized that the Giovanna players just suck. And then you fight a real Giovanna player, you're like, wow, damn, Breaker Dave is pretty good. And you're like, yes, I could cry for a little bit. But then as you get better as a player, you're like, you know what? I think I win this character. I win versus this character. You fight AK, and you're like, wow, that was a beginner combo right there? Wait, before we finish this, Dark Lord, how do you feel about Geo versus Viking? Geo wins 8-2? Viking sucks. God damn it. Damn it, bro. We almost made it, guys. We, we got to go back to page one again, man. God damn it, dude. The Dark Lord has spoken, bro. We must listen. We must obey Dark Lord. Dark Lord. Lord, Dark, Blank Lord. Dark, Drip Lord. I am so sorry for my antics. After this, we're raiding Dark Lord. If Dark Lord streams, he's about to get raided. We we need everybody to surround Dark Lord in a circle and we just kneel down and anything he say, we just be like, Dark Blank Lord has spoken. Back to the next one, look. We are in a behemoth typhoon, ladies and gentlemen. And I wanna say to keep it a buck, 85.99. You'd be like, yeah, I could win this. I could just parry, right? But then you realize, your parry options don't work. If you parry at a certain range, it doesn't make it easy for you. If you miss, you definitely go into the moon. So then you're like, yo, 
biking sucks, bro. You got Skyfish, Thunderbird, no stages of grief. America wins again. No more meaty behemoth typhoons. But then you realize, then you realize, then you realize to yourself, maybe if I could just time it perfectly, I could just cry for a bit. Gold Lewis Neutral is actually pretty good against Spike. Maybe it will develop to, I want to complain, but it's fair. But I think this is a good, nice place to set. Gold Lewis is broken. The reason why Gold Lewis is broken is because he has broken minds, he has broken sticks, he has broken people's confidence. He's broken a lot of things. So clearly he's broken. And yeah, man, we have been talking about this character for a lot of times, right? Happy chaos. Let me ask you biking mains in the chat. Are you guys really happy when y'all fight chaos? Are you guys really happy? I don't think none of us is happy. But you know what's crazy? Even though it's not fun, it's a pretty fair matchup. I actually think biking does pretty well, you know? I don't get to parry most of the time, but you know what I got? I got some great air normals. I got some great ground normals. It's a pretty fair matchup. I actually think it's pretty good. It's like a man, it's like, it's like, ah, you, you, you just made it. Yeah, stay moving. We're gonna let you slide. We're gonna let him slide. But I think, I think Biking does pretty all right. I don't think it's ever gonna go here. And the reason why, because I don't think we ever gonna agree that we don't think this character is so annoying. That matchup indeed demands a lot of patience. But I think at best it might go, it might go here. I think another matchup that could go up is up here. I think a matchup could go up here, but we're gonna cry for a bit. So now it's Mr. Frederick. Frederick is fi finally here, ladies and gentlemen. We're finally here with Frederick. We came a long road, guys. It's been four hours. He's finally here. And you know what's crazy? Because soul is good, biking sucks. But then when you actually know how to play neutral, you actually know how to think a little bit, you like, I'm still a crybaby, so I'm still gonna cry. But then, the Guilty Gear player and all of us is like, I wanna complain, but it's fair. We don't wanna admit that it's fair but it's pretty fair. Is it the fairness that we like? No, but it's the fair It's the fair that the court has given us. Even if we don't agree with the, the placement, we can all agree, biking sucks. And you know who's winning this? The biking players are winning all of these matchups. The biking players are winning this because biking sucks. If I hear somebody in the chat tell me in my screen that biking is pretty good, we gonna have some problems. I'm gonna invite you to a Discord call and we are going to have a podcast live. Bike is pretty good. Hold on. What's uh? What's going, what's going on? What? What you gotta say? I, you know, bike is pretty good. You know, got some good normals. Just got some good set play. Got some one wing frame counter. Wait, you know what I'm saying? Wait, so so you telling me that according to Twitter, she doesn't suck? According to Twitter, she doesn't suck. Damn, Chad, I don't know what to think about myself. Like, I got exposed by one of the best players. Literally, that the Sunbox, yeah. Yes. My opinion matters for over everyone's. Literally, one of the best players to play every fighting game. They came to my stream, Captain, and Deadass <laughs> told me on my stream that Twitter said this character is good. Clearly, Twitter is right. 